Okay, this is Norm from Norm's Rare Guitars. Uh, listen, we've got uh, a couple celebrities in here. I'm going to do the first, most important one first, and that's Joey down here. Yes, yes. This guy over here, he's one of the senior citizens of uh, Norm's Rare Guitars, and he's, uh, he's one of our steady customers. And then along with Joey, he brought along another buddy of ours, Bruce Kulik from the group KISS and also from Grand Funk Railroad. So and Bruce is one of the great players that comes in the store and he's agreed to doodle on this Paul Reed Smith that was made for us. So Bruce? Oh, and what's the show that you're on? Plug the show. Well, I've been on the, you know, on classic, uh, you know, VH1 Classics, they've been doing that metal show and also, you know, the Fantasy Camp, they've been yeah. covering that as well. So what about in Vegas? Are you doing that show? You know, that thing uh, kind of went went away for a bit, but you never know what's going to happen. You're, you're always a phone call away from something interesting coming Yeah, the out. VH1 thing was but great. But the VH1 though. stuff, the, that metal show is really cool, and uh, obviously it's great to get that kind of exposure, but, um, you know, I would prefer just hanging out in a guitar store. <laughs> well, I like yeah, having well, here's you. Here's the guitar store. <laughs> Hey, anytime I got a, I can play a beautiful. This one they made for you, huh? They got a sign there. See that, Paul Reed Smith. Anyway, Norm always has a lot of amazing instruments. There's never a dull moment in here, and I've actually met and uh, befriended quite a few other celebrities, other guitar players that uh, I always heard of, but I actually made a friendship with them right here at Norm's store. So, besides selection, you never know who you're going to run into. Well, one of two. Okay, okay. that's always good. Yeah. But yeah, I see there's a second signature there too. Yeah, it's very similar to the guitar that Paul owns. That's his own guitar. The, yeah, like on the it's, cover of that guitar magazine, you see that guitarist magazine? I'm pretty sure it's... it's it could it's be like, that, like, yeah. It's that, got like the violin wood, right, the violin, right. yeah, um, it's amazing. It's very upgraded, oh, yeah. you know. Absolutely. What kind of fingerboard is it? Um, well, he's got all the woods uh, written Laos. down. Was it? It's a Laos fingerboard. A Laos fingerboard. Right. Okay. Great. And then your old Gibsons had the Brazilian Rosewood. <laughs> Absolutely. So it's all good. And Bruce has a lot of guitars. He's bought a lot of guitars from us over the years. Yes, I've done some damage here. Ouch. And then yep. a couple of things. Remember, for a while you were working with the Hard Rock. Yeah. And ironically Absolutely. enough, I was just in Hawaii on vacation. And I went to the brand new Hard Rock that's open up on Waikiki. And what's amazing about it was they have an interactive display. So I'm tapping on it, and all of a sudden, Kiss guitars come up. And sure enough, one of the things that we did something with, uh, actually two of them, they showed up on the interactive. They tell you where they are, which hard rock it was in, and one of them is in Dallas, and the other was like Gothenburg, uh, Very cool. uh, Sweden. So uh, I, lo I love that he, he got them out there for me. You know, and so we had we had a very good friend who worked at hard rock for many years, yeah, who's Don, no longer with sure. us, uh, Don, and uh, we loved the guy. He was great, and uh, you know I did a lot of stuff with them uh, for them through. Players like Bruce, and uh, you know, I'm thankful that sure. Bruce was willing to do that for us. So, and then when I'm reporting my vacation on Facebook, because you know you have to tell the world and Twitter, I showed a sunset, a little ukulele I found, and then of course, the guitar, you know, that I, that, that Norm got to the Hard Rock, you know, on the interactive display, cool. so that everybody could say like, yeah, cool, it's out there. So, I just so want like, to say Bruce is yes. one of my favorite rock players that comes in our shop. This guy, when some people just play and they can they can rock out, but this dude owns the guitar every time he plays. He's he's the bomb. And he's an excellent bass player too. Oh, I've bought some basses here. We've done some good deals yep. on basses. Yeah. All right. Enough about me. And uh, I got to get my dog to the to his doctor visit out here. So good to see. Is you. he still seeing the psychiatrist? Or... <laughs> yeah. Um, he, he's my shrink, actually. Oh, yeah, really? All right. Cool. Well, <laughs> right. don't forget to say goodbye to Joey over here, too. So. Joey, say goodbye. I know you're not too happy you're in the guitar store. There you go. He gave a little yeah. shake. He said, that's Joey's right. Joey's got a slight dental problem. <laughs> yeah. Other than that, you know. <laughs>